Hi hey everyone, this is DJ Kidna, also known as Kick Hopper on the TV Nihon forums. Uh, starting with this video, I'll be doing a series of toy reviews for uh, Japanese toys that I've had imported so far. Uh, mostly Kamen Rider toys, a couple of uh, Sentai toys, well, one Sentai toy. Uh, well, maybe we'll expand that a little bit later on. And, uh, but uh, let's go ahead and get right in. First review, Fajit Cell Watch. Uh, this is actually one of my later imports that I got. Um, so I, th I thought it was a pretty cool uh, gadget. I got it on eBay for a really good price, 20 some odd bucks plus shipping. And the shipping was pretty good, like maybe like $10, $15. Uh, anyway, really good, really good display piece. Um, pretty damn accurate to what the show is. Um, and the sound effects are really good. Uh, they put a lot of detail onto this. I'll go ahead and bring it up close to you guys so you can see it. And uh, if you look, it looks like a regular, you know, regular digital sports watch, which matches with the FIES details. Uh, it even has a little little text there that says 500M. Like, if it was a regular watch, it would be waterproof up to 500 meters. It's not really waterproof, guys, so don't try it. <laughs> I, I can't stress that enough. You'll ruin your toys. Also has a little Smart Brain logo on the uh, on the face of the watch, as well as um, little text for mode, light, forward, and adjust, as if it was a real watch. And in the center, you have the main stopwatch area. And underneath that, what also looks like a little um, time, it says 5:55 a.m. and 55 seconds, uh, which I thought was a nice little little gimmick there. Also has the Excel drive, which comes in and out. Um, that's not required to either leave it in or take it out for all the other noises to work, but it makes a nice little noise by itself. Uh, even the strap, the watch strap, really well detailed. It's actually rubber. Uh, the only problem I have with the watch strap is it's a little short. As you can see on this side, it's kind of short. I can get it on the last, maybe second to last notch on my wrist. Which you know it's made for it's made for children, so uh, it's to be expected. But I have, for instance, the uh, the Gecky Ranger Gong Changer um, for Gecky Violet, and it uses a nice little velcro strap like the second strap here, which fits really well. It's perfect for that. Um, speaking of this strap, if you guys cosplay, if you guys do the armor cosplays, like I know some guys in Indonesia do, this is removable. So it'll be a little more accurate, um, or you can keep it on with it, whatever floats your boat. Uh, let's see. Also down here, you have the um, item number, I guess, of uh, this five particular five gear item, SB five 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 W. Not sure what the W stands for. I guess it's watch. That would make sense, I guess. All right. So let's go ahead and turn this puppy on. On and off switch is right here. Has a nice little label underneath. And the on and off switch is right there. It's really well hidden from view. Uh, and matches with the color, so it's not really noticeable. So go ahead and turn it on. Pretty loud. Uh, nice little startup sound. Uh, I like that it has the repeating fives um, in the watch area, in the, in the face of the watch. Um, three main components of this. The fives Excel drive. The red startup button and this random black button that's on there. Um, the random black button just does random noises and lights and stuff. It doesn't really do anything specific to the show. Um, I'll go ahead and run through that real quick. Okay, I'll go ahead and turn it off and turn it back on. Um, Fives drive right here makes a nice sound when you remove it. Reformation. Does the reformation sound effect um, like with like in Fives when he inserts the drive? 
and his arm changes. Um, the mechanism for that is this little button right here. When it's pushed down, it's silent, and it starts it basically to let it know that when it let goes back up, it uh, makes a sound. Put a lot of details of the FISE drive like we do with all the other drives for the, for the phones. Nice little detail actually in the plastic itself. Uh, like I said, you don't need it in or out in order for the main feature to work, which is the red button here, which starts up the super speed mode of FISE Excel. So I'll go ahead and show that to you. Start up. And that's pretty much it. Um, pretty good toy overall. I got a really good deal on that, and there might still be good deals out there. Uh, definitely recommend it for collectors. Um, you could probably still find it on eBay. Um, from what I recall, the seller I got it from still had quite a few left. So if you get a chance, I do recommend picking it up. Uh, that's the end of this review. I hope you guys enjoyed it, found it useful. Uh, please leave comments. Um, any spam and whatnot will be deleted, so whatever. Uh, but I do enjoy criticism, uh, as long as it's serious criticism and not just trolling and flaming. Anyway, I uh, hope you enjoyed the video. There will be more to come soon, so stay tuned. And uh, thanks for watching.